He says Sueño has his family. You could have led with that. Got him. There aren't any other four Americans causing trouble for Sueño. He's not to talk. He's asking if you'll negotiate. Think Kumbaya and hug it out. This is El Sueño. It is a pleasure to finally speak with you. You want to hire us? You're four of the most dangerous people alive. Of course I want to hire you. What's up guys, GT Game here and welcome back to Ghost Recon Wildlands and this is a very exciting episode. It's only going to be a short episode probably, I don't know how this is going to turn out. But if you remember in the last episode we destabilised the very last production um, area and we also, uh, if I zoom out, God, I can't think what I'm doing. We also got the underboss, the Bouchon. Well, no, they're the Bouchons. They're the un she's the underboss. And now we're going after the head of production, El Yayo. Who, if you remember, was cutting his cocaine to make it more, eh, more, more pure. And El Sueño, the head guy, if I show you him, he's a very mean looking person. He is not happy, so he's on house arrest and his guards are in order to shoot him if he tries to escape. So we've got a little challenge on our hands, so we're at the scene now. Took me a fair while to drive here, gotta be, gotta be fair. And my main goal is to save him. Well, I think, I'm not sure. I'm just thinking if there's a place there where we can snipe people from. That might be an idea. Um, that seems to be the only hill nearby. Okay, let's run to that. Oh, that's good. Tree right in the way. That is perfect. Let's climb up here. Let's try over... Ah. This might be a little bit better. Maybe. Uh, can we climb any of this? Yep, we can climb this here. And let's prone. Let's just have a quick look, see what we can see. So, there's a guy in that room who somehow we managed to spot him, or perhaps he's behind the building, not really sure. Um, okay, this is officially the worst vantage point in the on the entire planet. Um, uh, there's literally nobody that I can see. Oh, there's a guy. I uh, won't let me mark him. God damn it. Okay, let's try going down here a bit. Perhaps we're too far for them to... S right, we marked him. Okay, let's go down. That was a lot higher than I thought it was. Right, there's that guy there. There's another guy near him. So, if we can get him marked, we can sink shot them. That's my thing hey, there. Baby makes three. Alright, okay. Sink shot him. Actually, no. Uh, okay, I'll sink shot the other guy. Right, three, two, one. Got him. Right, I'm expecting this mission to be extremely difficult, so... We have to take our time with this. Um, got him. Right, how are we going to do this? I'm thinking just pick people off for the time being. But if we can, assuming we can actually afford to get away with it. So the guy there, will he get spotted by anyone? I don't believe so. Ooh, glad I didn't take that shot. Okay, um, let's have a look over here. We shouldn't get spotted, we're right in the middle of a massive field, so... Hopefully we should blend in. Just right. That's a nice view with a pylon, and I have no idea what I'm talking about. Right, um, road. There's someone by this road. Come on, climb. Let's see if we can get a shot on them. Right, there's a person there. Just spotted one with some machine guns. He's 82 meters away. Um. Okay, let us, let's wait for him to... Let's see what he does. Where's he going? He's got two guns. He's one of those. Marking a tango. He's close to that local. Okay. Got him. Let's go down here. 
Come on, don't find the body. All right, there's a guy there. This is the place. Let's take this low and slow. Yep, that's my plan. The first thing they'll do is kill El Yayo. Copy that. Got him. Okay, is that all of them outside? Uh, I don't see anyone. Oh, Tango Mark, but he's got a civilian nearby. Okay, let's follow that guy. See where he goes, because if he finds that body, got him. Okay, we're still good. Right, reload. And switch to primary. Let's go over. Oh. No, no, no. Don't go in there, team, please. Who was that? Okay. There's someone on that balcony. There. Cage. Kill witness. What? Got him. There's one last guy, and there's Aliyayo. Put that gun away. Okay, we're still all right. I can't even see that guy. Okay, let's just do. Let's just get him and go. Vamanos. Taking you someplace safe. I cannot leave. Ah, uh, it won't let me stow it there. The cartel will kill my family. Okay, that's not good. How do I? Can I stow him in here anywhere? No, you're not gonna let me, really. Oh, it let me then. All right, front seat it is. Or back, either one. Just don't go on the minigun, or I will kill your family. Eh, uh, damn! I thought I shot him in the face then. Jesus. Right. Well, that was surprisingly easy. I'm worried. Right, there's no time limit, so we don't have to rush our team. They can get in the car, or at least two of them can. And now, oh, someone who wants to ask you some questions about your activities with the cartel. I'll tell you whatever you want to know, but only once my family is safe. Understand? Ah, here's part two of the mission. take me back where you found me. Still haven't told me who you are. I have heard rumors about the phantasmas who are making buildings burn, making things disappear, making people disappear. I thought they were just being super. RP's just ahead. Huh? No cut him off. Hey, rude. I get the feeling we'll be heading right, right back come out. Come on, again. grab it. Come on, head the car, Mr. Furcoat. And what are you going to tell us? This is quite a special episode, so I want to watch this cutscene. I should have known. CIA has brought in our own sicarios. Simon Bolivar said the United States was destined to plague the Americas with misery. Now that misery is upon my house. He says Sueño has his family. You could have led with that. These four gunfighters are your best last hope at saving your family. So are you going to play ball, or are you going to bury more kin? He has a good skin See, texture. Family, Look at the graphics on I that. Decide if I will talk. Short and sweet, that's how I like it. Right, so, yeah, now you know what we're going to do. Uh, I want the land rock. Hammer, whatever you want to call it. District of a village called Baya Floresta. We By a floresta. So when you find he's gone, that family's dead. Move fast, you say? Okay, I can do fast. It might involve going off cliffs, though. Like that, for example. And straight into a family of four. Ah, well, they're dead. Right, we need to save some booty now. Hi. Coming Just ignore us. Floresta. Oops. Nayo's wife and son are supposed to be somewhere in the village. Keep your eyes open. Okay, the going in in a land rock, not a good idea. I really can't drive this thing. Let's pop out here and infiltrate on foot, I think. See, we're already suspected and we haven't even done anything. 
So, yeah. Caution is my middle name. Actually, it's Robert, but you know. Uh, right, ammo. Okay. I think a car would be quite good cover. Anyone gonna... Oh. Anyone else? Maybe? Oh, shit. Turkey mushroom. Oh. Shit balls. There is someone over there. Come on, poke, peek me, peek me. Come on. No, you wanna. Grenade, watch out. Shit. Grenade, grenade. That gonna Got him. And I'm gonna go over here. Any other mofos wanna fuck with me? I'm opening fire. Oh, explosion. Right, come on, where? There's a guy right near me somewhere. Oh, there's one somewhere. Eh, cross. Cross, damn it. I'm like one shot away from death, that's not good. Okay, there's more coming this way. I'll take care of these, you guys take care of them. Where are they? Where are they? Where are they? There they are. How can he throw a grenade that grenade, far? Grenade. Bang. Right, where else are they? Let's go back over here towards the fight. Okay, there's one right there. In the balls. Okay, where's that guy? There. Shot him. Right. This is actually a pretty tricky one. Urban combat is always the trickiest, I find. Right, where? There's a guy there. I just saw him. Got him. Right, and... Okay. Shots fired. Uh, there's one on my left somewhere. There he is. Grenade. Uh, no, 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 no. Don't think so. Bang. Right, and bring back some of my health. There's a guy... Ah, no, bad time to reload. Come on, come on, peek me, peek me, peek me, come on. Got him. Right, there's one in there somewhere, keeps running round. I'm gonna get him. Gonna kill him. Oh, no, there's one on my left. Where are they? There. It's annoying, sometimes on burst mode it freezes when I press the trigger. Oh, there's another one on my left. I don't even, oh, there he is. It's that guy. Where are you? Where'd you go? There. Got him. God, you scared the shit out of me then, Halt. Come on, don't do that. It's bad for your health. Right, there's... What's going on up there? My guest is getting antsy. Come on. You find Yayo's there's a family? few more here. We're working on it. Understood, just hurry, okay? It'll be damned ironic if the dude has a coronary waiting for his wife and son. Roger that. <laughs> that would be ironic. Funny, but ironic. Right, they're in somewhere here. Oh, shots fired. Where is... Where are they? They're somewhere... Or did my team take care of them? My team's taking care of them, I think. Alright, let's go in here. More shots fired. This sounds like a genuine war zone. <laughs> like. Heads up. I got eyes on Yaya's wife and son. Pero Dios mío. Uh, no, I want guys. this first. It case. Worth it. Ooh, weapons case. Investigate. Outside. Quite a lot from this place. Fair play. Ah, get out the door. Right, and I want... Yep, investigate that. That's a great drawing a of a map. And I'll take that, whatever it is. I don't even know what that was, but I'll have it anyway. Oh, uh, rangefinder. Ooh, hoo -hoo. snipper riffle. Uh, parts. Uh, where is it? Rail. Uh, no. Ooh, long barrel. I need to get that. I need to find that long barrel. I don't know where that is. Uh, okay. Yeah, nothing we can really. Eh, yeah, nothing really to use. Oh well. Alright, you guys, hello. Just don't panic. 
Vamos a salir de aquí. Hello. De verdad. Nunca, nunca, Vamos a salir de aquí. Carajo. Don't touch me. Calm down, Chewie. Your father sent us. You expect me to believe that? You can believe whatever the fuck you want as long as you shut up and follow instructions. Now follow me. <laughs> Both packages secure. Let's get them back to their old man. Right, I've got a feeling something bad's gonna happen. That is one seriously damaged minivan, but it's drivable and it's fine on this side for some reason. Right, get in the Sumitsu. Hang on, I'll drive. Come on, pop in, pop yeah, in. I'll meet you there. Yeah, get in the boot, why not? Actually, that's a good tactic if you could actually open the boot and fire. Game freeze. But you can't, so pretty pointless. It's the old man's fault, isn't it? It's too greedy and too proud. A man cannot be both. Cállate, mijo. Rudy does his best for his family, for the cocaleros. How do we even know he's with you? How do we know he's safe? That you aren't using us to get to him. Just like esos charros, esos mexicanos. I never said we weren't using you. But you are safe with us, and El Yayo is safe. I have seen La DEA and CIA do too much evil to my people. Do not expect me to trust you. Kuru gringos, Kumara Mama Coca. Viva Mama Coca! I think they just cursed us. Not really sure. Whoops. Didn't mean to crash. Right, come on. Into the extraction zone. Yet another cutscene. I want to see this one. Rodolfo. Mi Rosita, estás bien? Si, mi vida. Papa, what trouble had you gotten us into now, old man? I just got you out of trouble, kid. Don't expect us to believe that. Ustedes blanquiñosos yankees only bring problems to Bolivia. I may be too young to have marched with the Cocaleros in 96, but I have seen the scars on the protesters who were beaten. I'll eat a dick. I'm sick of this anti-American bullshit. We're not your enemy, kid. But you're not our friend either. Tranquilo, mijo. I have made deals with many devils in my time, and it has always been to protect my family, to ensure that my people, los Cocaleros, survive. Now I have made my deal with you, Agent Bowman. I'm sure to regret it later, but for now, it will allow us to see another day. Just have a nice little bit of my drink while that cutscene was going on. And also turned down my headphones because I realised the volume was all the way up and I nearly went deaf. Right, now what? Is that the end of the mission? I hope not, because if it is, that's the shortest mission ever. Oh, game freeze. Want. Nobody's happy about it, but yeah, looks that way. Fucking ingrates. They know we saved their lives, right? All I know is the cartel's gonna have a hell of a time making cocaine without El Yayo. The rest yep. is my pay grade. I heard that. Production is now officially stopped in all of this area. Now, hmm, what are we gonna do next? Who should we go after next? The Beauty Queen seems quite fun to play with. El Boquita. Uh, what's this? Smuggling. Influence, security. It might be a good idea to take out influence. Um, after all, it only has four legs, four bouchons. This has five, so... Um... Ah, huh. how is the Bouchon unknown yet we've done two missions there? That, Montoyak, where is that? There, oh, yeah, Mr. Five Star Difficulty. But, you know what, that might actually be quite fun. But, for some reason, I can't spot any missions. Oh, there's one. Uh, a Santa Blanca communication center in Montoyak could contain message, message logs identifying the cartel's senior military instructor. Enter the communication center and hack its message logs. Ooh. Let's do We've it. we got a location on a Santa Blanca communications hub in Montioc. I need you to hack the hub's message logs and see if we can ID the guy running their training program. I'm taking the bike. Right, so ahead, my up. plan was just to do that mission with Al Yayo. But that was literally 20 no, minutes. So... The activity found a message for you on one of Santa Blanca's websites message for us there aren't any other four americans causing trouble for swing ow to talk he's that he'll negotiate think kumbaya and hug it out the meeting's bait but it could also be a chance to draw swing you out okay sure. change of plan there's also a chance to get yourself killed there's nothing to stop this from becoming a two-way shooting gallery send us the info if he wants to throw 
Okay, we're not going there anymore. No, get rid of that. We can throw lead. I don't think you understand. Why won't you get rid of that waypoint? Go away. Uh, but bum there. Perfect. This is a bad idea. Bowman, I understand. Send us the info. And we'll decide. Fine. Do what you want. Bowman out. Okay, we got a new mission. Where is it? El Sueño's proposition. Reach the RV. Is that it? Montu. El Sueño wants to meet. Montu Puncho. Maybe he wants to negotiate. Maybe he wants to kill you. Either way, watch your ass. This sounds fun. Okay, so this episode just took a turn. That is oh so much better. Forget that mission for the time being. It will get done, but first I want to meet El Sueño, or get killed doing it, either one. So I will cut out this drive, because not much is really going to happen, and I will bring you back when we get there. At left. We are nearly there, guys. We are now pretty much on our way to meet El Sueño. I need to stop crashing into every single thing. Uh... Let's, uh, let's just pull over here and have a little bit of a look. <laughs> what was that physics? Like, really? It just says reach the RV. I don't know. It is worrying. Let's have a look. Um, Can't see anything. Okay. Let's walk it, I guess, then. Let's go on foot and climb across here, jump down here, perfect. I know, something is, well, obviously very sketchy about this. Um, I've got a feeling I might be getting shot at in about two minutes. So if you want to see that, stay tuned. <laughs> uh, something is so off about this. Keep your eyes open. Uh, yeah, an abandoned cartel base. What the hell? Still don't see anybody. Fuck is going on? Stay sharp. Watch for an ambush. Yeah, that's a good idea. I hear a phone. Phone. That's no IED. It's ringing too much. Find it. There's the phone. We're gonna answer. I ain't picking that shit up. Fuck's sake. Okay, what is going to happen now? Come on, use it. Hola, caballeros. This is El Sueño. It is a pleasure to finally speak with you. And here I thought we were going to meet face to face. Don't tell me you're running late. I apologize for the subterfuge. But people in our line of work, we must be cautious. But I am not a liar. There are no Sicarios in your area. No need that. I only wish to talk. Tell us where you are, then we'll talk. I am only attempting to end the bloodshed. There is no need for it. It's bad for my business. And it is bad for Bolivia. This country has been trying to get back on its feet for decades. Do not kick it back down. Says the guy who turned this country... Sueño really has board. something against liars. Something of value to say. There are four cars in front of you. Consider them a signing bonus. You better say that again. <laughs> Must be something wrong with my hearing. You want to hire us? You're four of the most dangerous people alive. Of course I want to hire you. Every day you risk your life for your country. And your government base you casi Put those skills to work for me. For Santa Blanca. And you will make more money than you can imagine. Sorry. We're going to have to politely ask you to go fuck yourself. <laughs> See, we only came to this meeting to kill you. The fact that you aren't here just means you get a little more time on this earth. But I figure you should start saying your goodbyes, because we're coming for you, and we're gonna burn you down. So be it. I will enjoy watching you try. Ooh. I still want the car, though. You're damn right I'm having the car. Bowman, we're still breathing. The swing you made us a pretty lucrative job offer. Job offer? Did you take it? Benefits package wasn't correct. <laughs> we told him we were going to kill him. So you're stuck with us for now. Fair enough. Be in touch. Ooh. That was interesting. I'm going the wrong way here. I don't want to scratch the car. It's such a nice car. 
I really like this guy. What is it? Like a Dodge cal Calibre? Something like that. Don't jump it. Well, guys, I guess that is it. Production is officially done. Uh, we managed to talk to El Sueño. It's a shame we didn't meet him. And there goes the car. God damn it. I like that car. But yeah, this has been a pretty interesting episode. I'm glad production might finally manage to finish. So make sure you come back for the next episode. I'm thinking we'll go to Montoyoc. And hopefully we can start tackling more underbosses and then eventually meet El Sueño. So if you guys want to see that, make sure you come back for the next episode. I will see you then. Peace out, guys.